Hello? Hello? Wizard of Oz by Scrizzle Scrazzle. Dorothy was a bad maniac and she was sad. Burn it away. Oh. Burn it, burn it. Burn it all away. Burn it. <laughs> <laughs> no pleasure in life. No pleasure, not for me. Not for Dorothy Omaha. <laughs> No, I'm glad she's dead. <laughs> oh, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> 
you stole my candy. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Nah, go ahead. You think you are so tough. Come on. No, no, no. Toto was a mean puppy, and also Dorothy's husband. Hi, <laughs> arf arf arf. I'm Toto the puppy dog, and I have secretly bad and terrible plans for my ex-wife, Dorothy. <laughs> I'm the bad doggy of the woods and I play mind games with people. <laughs> arf, arf, arf. That's right. That's right. Arf, arf, arf. <laughs> I killed you one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a puppy, and Dorothy was not a very good wife to me. She made a poo poo in my pee pee cup, and I told her she was out of order. And she said she was innocent because she had to poo poo so badly. But I think she was guilty, and she's bad, and I hate her. She should be punished for her bad behavior instead of laughing. She shouldn't be laughing at her bad behavior and laughing to herself. It was then that I realized Toto had left these crazy pictures to make me remember the worst day of my life. The day I melted to Queen Ridge. Something I never wanted to think about. We're horrible. No! <gasps> what sort of maniac will leave these pictures like this along the trail? Ha ha ha! What kind of crazy maniac indeed? I wonder who it could be, hmm? <laughs> There's one crazy maniac I can think of. One crazy maniac I can think of right off the top of my puppy head. And that's me. <laughs> I'm Toto the puppy dog. Arf, arf, arf. This is what happens when you mess with me. Sorry, not sorry, okay? What was that? I thought I heard a puppy's voice. I wonder if that no good puppy left these silly pictures along the path. Dorothy remembered the bad thing she did. Hello? A dream of a strong cup of orange, but this is too weak. It's strong enough, darling. No! Fine. I will do as you ask, but beware. The streak you want is going to be extraordinarily strong. Tangy and my... Yes, this should be sufficient for me. Yo, Dorothy, what's up? You ain't been around in a minute. Yes, I have. I've been sitting here for 15 minutes waiting for my strong cup of orange drink. Yo, that drink looks mad strong, B. Your ass can't handle that shit. Yes, I can. 
I actually requested a strong cup of orange drink for my sweet tooth. Same old Zorthian shit, I guess. Some things will never change. What do you mean? Everybody in Oz knows about your crazy sweet tooth, Zorthi. No, I don't. Yes, we all call you sugary Zorthi behind your back all the time. Sometimes we laugh about it. Sometimes I take a whole pound of white sugar, pour it on my spaghetti and sauce, and I say, Hey, everybody, look at me. I'm sugar and zombie. <laughs> Stop that. You must face punishment. <laughs> We now return to the present day. I can't believe some sick mania dropped these pictures along the path. Does this sick, terrible, crazy mania want me to feel even worse than I already do? I totally want to feel dead now. Dorothy was raised in the Oz traditions, and she used a whip to punish herself, <laughs> to purge herself of her sins. <laughs> <laughs> I am a mean old puppy. <laughs> I totally made Dorothy feel even guiltier than before. My plans worked. <laughs> I knew the pictures would totally make Dorothy sad. Now she'll probably commit suicide or something. <laughs> Good witch asked Dorothy what bad thing she did. Hello, Dorothy. I am the good white witch. Who are you? Be quite honest. I don't know any good witches. Don't be a stupid jerk to me, Dorothy, for I have a very important secret special message for you. Stop calling me that. That's my name. Why should I even listen to messages anyways? Some maniac left me one and made me feel sad and made my guilt worse. For if it's the guilt you wish to get rid of, Dorothy, then you must hear me out. For I have a secret special message that's going to help you. If you don't stop saying my name, I'm gonna go pee-pee on your poo-poo cup. You are making a bad mistake, Dorothy. What's a mistake anymore? If the old mistakes make you feel even sad, what's the point of not making any more mistakes in the future? Can you tell me? Unfortunately, this is a question we all ask ourselves, and I do not have any more answers for you. But I do have a very important secret special message for you, Dorothy. 
Well, tell me what's this message that makes it so special? First, you must prove to be pure of heart. Can you do that? How can I do that when my heart is totally full of guilt, like a duty do? Dorothy, it is not up to you to judge the filthiness of your own shitty heart. Okay, fine. Total trick, Dorothy. Did the same bad stuff. Tell me, Dorothy, did you really take a pee pee in your ex husband's poo poo cup? Because that's what he said you did. Ex husband? Are you talking about Toto the puppy? That's not my ex husband. He's just another st stupid, silly puppy. So, what really happened that night? The night that your marriage ended, hmm? I'm entering my home now. This is my home! Well, look at my dry little poo-poo cup. It could really use some pee-pee. But why would I pee pee in a poo poo cup for no real purpose? Hmm. Well, I don't love Dorothy. And I don't want our totally stupid relationship. Maybe I should pee pee in my poo poo cup and say that she was the one to pee pee in my poo poo cup and just end it. Just end it all. She's always so totally guilty about killing that silly witch. She's always sad. It makes our marriage shitty. There's no reason not to pee pee now. Pee pee in the poo poo. Pee pee in the poo poo. Why is my pee coming out so slowly? Do I have a prostate problem? Ah! I can't believe this! Well, Toto, what is it now? What is it? You clearly made a pee pee in my poo poo cup! And now wet pee pee soaked poo poo splashed all over my tennis slippers! Oh, Toto, I'm so sorry, but I have no memory of me doing pee-pee in your poo-poo. But my guilt has made me totally sleepy. It's like I'm a sleepy bunny, but I don't know what to do anymore. You never know, Dorothy. That's the problem with the sham of a marriage. You never let me put my pee-pee in your pussy, but you have no problem doing a pee-pee in my poo-poo. So I want an annulment, and we are going to see a Catholic church? A priest? Immediately, to get an annulment, okay? Fine, I suspect the ruse. The only ruse is your love, Dorothy. Your heart could never love a puppy, let alone another person, to be honest. This marriage is a joke. We now return to the present day. So you're telling me, Dorothy, that Toto the puppy dog poo-pooed in his pee-pee cup just to get away from you? Yes, because he's silly and he's stupid, but my guilt has ruined his love for me. I don't know. Maybe he had the peepee -pee to save his own shitty puppy heart. Why is his heart so shitty? Because you have to have a shitty heart. Do you have to have a shitty heart to love someone, but then not love them at a later point in time? I mean, wouldn't a regular heart just love forever? Unfortunately, Dorothy, I do not have the answers that you seek. But you have proven yourself to be pure of heart, so I can share my special vision with you. The good witch tells Dorothy a story about the wizard. I saw a vision of a man in a wizard suit. I believe his name to be Wizardy Wizard. Yo, check it. It's 1996. Got knife on my blood. 
shit on my dick. You gotta lift your leg and move that ass. Come to Oz and do the Oz dance. You gotta throw your hands up. Act like a piece of shit. Act like you just shit yourself. And you're hiding it like you're a stupid jerk. Cause that's the way it goes. Welcome to the 90s. Yeah, 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 yeah. Calm down, bro. Yo, calm down, bro. Calm down. The fuck up. It's nineteen ninety six, and the future is here. We're all best friends, whether white, black, or queer. What you gonna do on a Saturday night? Let's go to the mall and catch some fights under the escalator. Looking up girl skirts, make you so hard that your dick will fucking hurt. 1990, the 80s is over. We don't want that noise. Embarrassing toys, Rubik's Cube, Nintendo is a home. There's, there's my piano. You, you, you can't take the wizard's piano. Ah! Liberace there. <laughs> Who put you here, you cutie? <laughs> oh. The picture and everything. Uh, Scott Bale, you're as pretty as the day they hung my grandfather. Of my piano. Ah. I'm the squizzle squazzle. And I'm putting hay on you until you're dead. <laughs> I'm the wizard. You can't do this. <laughs> The wizard does not deserve what is about to happen to him. Going to happen? What do you mean, you, si you silly witch? I just saw your vision. You are mistaken once again, Dorothy. Mistaken how? What sort of crazy ruse are you trying to pull? This is nonsense. No, it is not nonsense, Dorothy. That vision I showed you is a vision from the future. Only two days from now, Wizzy Wizard will be murdered by Scrizzle Scrazzle. Scarecrow. Why do you keep saying Scarecrow? Because he is the king of the Scarecrows, Dorothy. Stop saying my name. I mean, Dorothy is your name. Do I have the wrong Dorothy? Repeating another person's name is a form of verbal masturbation. You're probably coming now. You may as well be doing a form of spectral rape. Enough with these accusations, Dorothy. I am trying to help you. If you save Wizzy Wizard, your conscience will be clear. You will be a hero. You will no longer have to carry all this guilt on your shoulders. Well, maybe I'll carry it forever. Or perhaps maybe I'll fall for your crazy ruse. I have nothing to do anyway. So you believe me? I'm sure it's a ruse. But what other choice do I have? 
Just leave me be. Just like everyone else leaves me. Fine, Dorothy. I'll leave you alone. But just remember one thing. If you wish to make it to Emerald City, you must follow the yellow brick road. find that yellow brick road if it's the last thing I ever do because I'm Dorothy of Vox and no silly puppy can hurt me Dorothy meets a scarecrow He's the one that I'm supposed to come here to stop. There's only one Scrizzle Scrazzle, and that's me, and I'd be no scarecrow. If I was a king, do you think I'd be getting eaten right now? By roaches, no less, good sir! Hey, I am no sir. I am Dorothy of Oz. Dorothy of Oz? When we were together, I would sometimes imagine her returning him from the fair and saying, Toto, pack your things, it's over. And I'd think, well, what if I should say, why Dorothy, why, I love you so much, but I, I know I'd say nothing. I'd just stare at her, I'd be aloof. Too aloof to live. that I'm supposed to stop right now. Please, Dorothy, I'm begging you. The pain is too much. Scrizzle Scrazzle, what do you even know about pain? Do you even know about real pain? The kind of pain that makes you totally sad all the time? I can still hear her screaming, you know. <laughs> We just want to eat little scrabble. Do the good one. Come, we 
smelly poop. I'm out of here. Why is this weird girl hiding on the floor here? here? This is Grizzle Scrabble's Scrabble 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 dungeon. dungeon. Us roaches get wavy bodies by psyching little girls with poo poo in their dungeon. Yes, it's my turn now, Scrizzle Scrazzle. Scrizzle, Scrazzle, can I ask you something? Yes, right. Is there something so shitty about me that everybody just thinks that I stink? Dorothy punished herself by putting pieces of the Emerald City in her shoes. This barbed wire should do the trick. Mark my words. <laughs> so much guilt. Hello, friend. What brings you to our spaghetti party? Oh, uh, I don't intend on being in the spaghetti party. Spaghetti is disgusting. I never eat it. It's slime like worms, and you know, only disgusting people eat it, so. Oh no! I'm shaking in my boots. Why is this kid being so spooky? Look what you've gone and done. You spooked the lion. Well, oh, I'm really sorry. I didn't mean to spook the lion. You should be sorry. Uh, What's your name, anyway? Dorothy. Well, Dorothy, you owe me something now. And you owe my friend something, too. Uh, what could I have that you guys possibly want? I want you to give me your stomach. My tummy? Why? Yes, you're gonna join our spaghetti party.
can't do it, y'all. I can't do it. I can't do this anymore. I hate these disgusting noodles. You all are. Yeah, you spoke to me, Dorothy. You spoke to me bad. Okay, fine. I'll just eat more noodles then. Spaghetti baby! No. No. <laughs> spaghetti baby! Quit calling me spaghetti baby! My name's Dorothy! Spaghetti, spaghetti baby. baby! Spaghetti baby! Spaghetti baby! baby. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! No! We won't stop! Spaghetti baby!
That's right, Dorothy. You're a bad murderer. <sighs> Please kill yourself. It's the right thing to do. Yes, you're right, Wicked Bitch. Suicide is the right thing. Suicide is the best thing! I'm Toto the puppy dog, and you can't do this! No, Toto puppy, leave me alone. It's my time to die now. You can't! You can't die! Why? Give me one good reason! Because I love you, Dorothy! I've loved you ever since the first moment we've met! It's too late now. You should have met me earlier. With this crown, I thee wed. No! You're making a mistake, silly puppy. This is not the way of things. I do not care about the way! I only care about my heart! Everyone knows about you, Toto. Everyone knows you have a crappy and shitty pile of poop where a proper heart should be. That's not true! Have a cup of orange drink, good sir? No, I can't stand powdered drinks! You can't do this, Dorothy. We're married now and I own you. You can't kill yourself. Champion of the guards, take her away! Follow me, Dorothy. No, no, no. You're married now, Dorothy. Married to a puppy. Ha! No, this marriage is a ruse! She was right. She was right. We now return to the present day. Where's everybody? You were right, Dorothy. The Good Witch? What are you doing here? What was I right about? It was all rigged. All from the start. I rigged you from the start. Stop it! Stop being a maniac! I'm, oh, I'm not, not a maniac. maniac. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually just a puppy. The Good Witch was Toto the whole time. Toto, did you eat the Good Witch? No! I was the good witch. I was the good witch the entire time. Now everyone knows you're poo. How do you feel about that? I already knew I stank, Toto. I already knew it was rigid from the start. I was rigid to fail, rich to burn that witch. Now wind me up, wind me like a doll so I won't do anything but feel guilt. This isn't what I wanted, Dorothy. It was just meant to be a ruse. Everything was just meant to be a ruse. It's not you, Toto. I welcome your clever ruses. Especially when I'm the one being targeted. I looted pleasure. I want to suffer. I want to suffer all my guilt and burn it away. You can't just burn it away. Can't you see that? Can't you see that? I don't want to see you anymore, Toto. Dorothy, no. No, Dorothy. No, you're being a maniac. Dorothy burns her eyes out. Oh! <laughs> 
Don't be sorry, Dorothy. It's not your fault. I should have loved you better. Hey, Sweet James, here to remind you that your life matters. Someone would miss you as fast as help is only a call away. If you have those nasty, dirty thoughts about suicide, make sure you call the Suicide Prevention Hotline. Numbers on the screen now. Somebody loves you. Gabriel, it's me, the ghost of your late wife. Gabriel, you didn't do sex enough during our marriage, and you didn't eat my pussy enough. The reason I committed suicide was because you didn't fuck my pussy hard. And I'm a Catholic, so I'm in hell now, and all the abortions we had are chasing me through hell, Gabriel. I hate you. I can't wait for you to die so we can be in hell together. I miss you, my love. Yo, check it. It's 1996. Got knife on my blood. Shit on my dick. You gotta lift your leg and move that ass. Come to Oz and do the Oz dance. You gotta throw your hands up. Act like a piece of shit. Act like you just shit yourself. And you're hiding it. Like you're a stupid jerk. Cause that's the way it goes. Welcome to the 90s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Calm down, bro. Yo, calm down, bro. Calm down. It's 1996 and the future is here. We're all best friends, whether white, black, or queer. What you gonna do on a Saturday night? Let's go to the mall and catch some fights under the escalator. Looking up girl skirts make you so hard that your dick will fucking hurt. 1990, the 80s is over. We don't want that noise. Embarrassing toys, Rubik's Cube, Nintendo is a hoe and I'm out.